Thank you, Vicky, and good evening. Even I tried logging into the website, which took over five minutes to load. That may be because today was the first day where potentially millions of people were able to shop for healthcare insurance through this new online marketplace. After its passage in 2010, the Affordable Care Act, also known as Obamacare, opened its doors to a variety of health plans where citizens and legal residents will be able to choose an option that best suits their needs, income, and size of their family. The Rio Grande Valley has um, one of the highest rates of uninsured in the country, and so uh, this is a tremendous opportunity for people to get enrolled in coverage who may never have had it before. According to the Texas Medical Association, the state ranks as the first in uninsured residents, with about 25 percent of the population being uninsured. Buenas tardes, mi nombre es Vicky Mar. ¿Le puedo ayudar? This is one of the reasons why organizations such as MHP and Westlaco are offering to help the community navigate through the new system. So they want to know uh, how, how are they going to go about it, how am I going to get it, are they going to come to my house or do I go somewhere. So that's where we come in and we let them know that we'll be uh, going to community centers, to school districts and just everywhere in the community and they can also come to MHP and get information and we can guide them. Texas will count on 54 different plants to choose from. According to the U.S. Health and Human Services, it is estimated that premiums in Texas will be below the national average. Without insurance, you're really one hospital away, one hospital bill away from a disaster. Um, you can end up in the hospital, end up with a $30,000 bill that you're paying off for life, end up in bankruptcy. So part of insurance is making sure that you can avoid a disastrous life-changing situation like that. Um, on the other hand, you have prevention. So with health insurance, you're able to go to the clinic and maintain your health so that um, you're better able to avoid disasters like the ones we were talking about. Anyone not currently insured is not obligated to shop for a government-offered plan, but will have to find some sort of health care coverage by the March 2014 deadline. For more information on the new marketplace and how to seek assistance, you may call the 24-hour hotline with the number on your screen, as well as by logging on to www.healthcare.gov. Be sure to consult these sources for accurate and reliable information to avoid any possibility of fraud. It is also worth noting that even after purchasing a plan, it will not go into effect until the first day of January of this coming year. Oscar Morgan reporting for Fox 2 News. Vicki, back to you.